Hey guys, Super T Games. Just wanted to make a video on my favorite Volson build. This one is super fun. I love playing it. The builds combo together really well. And two handed swords are my absolute favorites. Now, first up is my favorite combo it is the Flight of Gavineer and Warpath. And I really like to put these together. I will chuck the hammer and then I'll chase it down with Warpath. And then I have splash damage at the end of Warpath. And then right when the hammer gets to me and goes past me, I call it back and normally I can hit some extra enemies, but oh man, I can clear a full hallway, no problem. And right below them I put my spec. I like to either spec into damage, damage increase, crit, or crit damage increase, and I'll normally go into splash damage or, or some kind of buff in the abilities. And now this combo right here is basically the reason why people play melee builds in most games, or especially dungeon crawlers. Uh, you got Bladestorm up there, and if you spec into it right, you can keep it going continuously. And then, you know, kind of depending on what you need, spec into different things. You know, at one point I had globes popping up so I could get heals, probably still do. And then, you know, mostly damage increases on that one, but then there's Bleeding Edge pop that guy, spin at the same time, it's a killer combo. You can't go wrong with it really. And for kind of movement buffs I use the Wings of Ishmir. In case I get trapped I can jump out of it, get completely out of the way. And at the end of it I spec into a AoE coming out of it so that I can kill stuff when I jump. It just kind of makes it a little more useful. And then of course Warpath from earlier. Jeez, you can run the entire length of a hallway in no time. It's not the most mobile class in the world, but these two are probably my favorite for the melee build. And for the fifth slot, when I get it, super close, I'm gonna throw in Sovereign Shout for the Rage Generation. Another good choice is Juggernaut. I, I used that one for a little while, it was fun. Pop a little shield, didn't have to worry about a whole lot. Real quick, my passive tree, I go Soldier, Warmonger, Child of Fury first, Furious Appetite, Frenzied Blows, pairs real good with Manic Slaughter. And I get a little defense, some Rage on Hit, and Crit, and I'm going to get Global Leech soon. And then a little defense, some Block, some Block, and then a Hit, Weapon Damage dealt to enemies when you block. So that hits pretty hard. Another crucial one. 200 max willpower and rage and then max willpower and max rage again right here beside it and after that I'm gonna come down here and get merciless lethality make my crits hit real hard love crits real big now here is one of the rougher bosses that I've fought they have a lot of good abilities to counter melee they got some good ranged his shield kind of stops you and pushes you back. Man, he is uh, rough. And all the adds. You see me die a few times here. It really, it's, it's bleeding edge and then just dodging. Like, I mean, you, you got to have some sort of ability that goes off automatically so that you can dodge stuff. Fights like this, oh man, not, not my proudest moment. But really, you just got to dodge and hope that you kill him before your life's over. And then when he's stunned, that's when I'll throw Gavineer. The thing hits like a truck, so I'll just chuck it. <laughs> Wait for him to have an opening, because that shield is, is hard to get through. And you'll see me die a few times. Embarrassing, but it's a, it is a fun fight. And these mobs, these bosses in areas like this, are by far the ones I have the most trouble with. You know, the ninja guy that jumps around, he's rough. The big mechanical guy, he, he really takes care of me. I feel like range classes probably tear this guy apart real, real quick, no problem. But I mean, you want to come into a game and have a build that you like. And the melee builds are always my favorite. And here is my primordial guy. I just charge up the slam and hit it down and then I build up his AoE frontal cone here until it gets real quick and then I slam down the, the fire. But I didn't use it very good. But. I appreciate it guys thank you for watching my video I'm gonna let you finish out the end of this here and then I will see you guys in the next video thank you so much take care